Guys, you would not believe how excited I am right now. It's flat, flat calm. I mean, flat calm. You would not believe how flat calm it is. It's like flat calm. Holy goodness. First time in like, first time in like three weeks it's been flat calm. It's flat calm. I'm like stoked. Uh, I'm gonna hop in the water today. I mean, seriously, like I'm gonna hop in the water today. Uh, high tide was an hour ago. Oh, you know I gotta catch a chopper when he goes by, right? A black hawk's going over your head. You gotta kind of get it, right? Where's it at? You know I can't leave a black hawk alone, right? That's an army black hawk too. So, all right. So, uh, yeah, I, I'm fully charged. I'm hopping in the water. Water headphones on. Hey, so if anybody wants me to promote their uh, promote their uh, store, like you you got a metal detecting store, send me something. Uh, send me those Grey Ghost headphones or the Tony Eisenhower. I've got a buddy that says they're like 170 bucks for a pair of headphones. I never would have paid 120 dollars if I had known I could have got the Grey Ghost for 140. I really, I really should not have purchased these Mind Lab headphones. They scratch your ears. They, the wind blows, and it sounds like you're in a tunnel. Like, you know, you need something. And uh, Bluetooth headphones that come with the Equinox 800 are spectacular. They make your ears sweat a little bit, but man, they're almost like, like you can't hear anything once you put them on. They're, they're spectacular. If I could wear the Bluetooth headphones in the water, I would. Um, yeah, if you own a metal detecting store and you want me to give you a shout out, uh, send me something and I'll give you a shout out. See, that's, that's there's no free transaction there. I'll give you some publicity. You send me something and, and I'll talk about your customer service or Rebecca or whoever is your secretary who sends me the stuff and then has communication with me. That's networking, guys. That's what I do. And that's why I'm building my channel the way that I'm building my channel. So. Uh, I'm back at Diamond Beach, guys. Uh, you just never know. Diamond Beach is like three miles long, so you never know where I'm at. I have a couple holes at Diamond Beach that I find a lot of stuff in. That's just what I do. I go to the hole and find the gold or rings or whatever that collects in the hole. It's been three weeks since anybody's been in the water, so come on, let's go get something. Sorry about all this talking. Later. Thanks, guys. All right, so look at all these people, right? So this hotel does this. Remember I said it was like one of the first ones to reopen and look at like 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. All these people are going in the water right here. So I hop in above this hotel, which will be above this set of kids over here. And then I'll head down through the main beach. And then when I get towards the main beach, if you start hearing more targets, you start gridding it off. Loud 21 to 23. Loud, loud 21 to 23. And this is, you know, you need to start 21 to 22. So the 22 throws me off the, the Lincoln or the Zinkin. Right? The 22 throws me off the Zinkin. I'm not sure. Oh, there it is. What is that, like a token or a foreign coin? A token. A token. It's a 17, sounds like a can. It had like a 20 pop to it. 14 through 16, 14 through 18. Sixteen. Definitely a can. I think I just I think I just went under it. Yep. Definitely a can. Or sunglasses. Huh. Or sunglasses.
Those are cute. Somebody will enjoy those. I should just give away all my sunglasses here at the beach while I'm here. It's a 26. First scoop. Oh, what did you fly over my hand? It was a dime. Should be able to scoop it right back up that quick, right? That's some pretty accurate scooping right there, wouldn't you say? Dime. It's just a banging, banging loud 21 through 23. Super loud. If I was to guess anything, I'd guess another can just by how loud it is. It's got a lot of grunts in it, so. I wouldn't go with a ring, but yesterday that silver ring I found had some grunts in it or near it. She says I got it. Yeah, look. <laughs> Vacation rentals. You see that, guys? Teaming vacation rentals. I'll return this key to them. I'm assuming it's like one of these places right over here, but either way, I'll give them their key back. Sinker. If uh, you're in an area and my friend, uh, my diver Italian friend, he said the area's just been really pummeled. His area's been pummeled by hunters. And he still ended up finding a real big chunky ring. And if you're in an area that's really pummeled, you just need to take a little time. And it's boring. And he did make the comment that he's bored. And, and it's boring, guys. Listen, I know it's fun to be in the water, but you're swinging a coil for an hour. You're not hearing any sound at all. But if you get too bored, you need to leave because you really need to be meticulous, right? So if it's hunted over, and this area is probably hunted a lot, but you need to find a spot that the hunters weren't able to get to and then hunt it. You guys have got to hear this. This is silver. It's the loudest silver silver you'll ever hear. I mean, it's loud. And my machine even overloaded. Look at this, it's got the overload, overload stuff going on. And now I quieted down a little, so let's see if I Maybe anything's in there. That's crazy. Why would this be this loud? That's loud, loud. Says I got it. Whatever that is, not silver. That was that was loud, loud. Daily vape. I didn't bring you guys along to see the daily vape. Full tab. I'm not sure why I didn't turn it on. That's 36 cents I had in the change spill. Totally forgot about the camera people were talking to me. I totally forgot I was recording. Look at that iced out. It's like iced out set of set of frames. There's no glass in it. I'm guessing it's a guess guess. God knows who I am. Guys, the 
lyric from the song I just passed the radio that was going and it said uh, God knows where I'm going God knows who I am and I just looked up guys and I thought about like some of the people that have just passed some some people that have passed in my life that are friends family my grandfather the people that I care about and then I just I don't know I miss them I miss them a lot. So I don't know if you guys can see that parachute coming down or not. I wonder what it's got on it. Could be a balloon that went up and popped and it's on its way down and I just looked up to see a sign from the heavens. I don't know. It's an egret called the Golden Slippers. Didn't find any gold today, but I found that Golden Slippers. It's an 11 12. Oh, I just felt something. That's. It's kind of what I felt. It's like pair number what, like three today? I think so. Those are kind of cute though. Guys, how cool is that? Check out the great blue heron sitting on that chair under that cabana. How freaking cool is that? I wish I had a real camera. Even my iPhone would be great, guys. How spectacular is that? Is that amazing or what? What a smart bird. Man, I wish I had a camera. That is a world-class photo right there. How beautiful is that? Guys, so let me tell you a little bit of, a little bit of a story about Vermont Derrick. That bird sitting on that chair gives me the same feeling as finding a gold ring. I just looked up into the sky to see how blessed I am because I'm so blessed because I get to be outside and see stuff like that. That's always fun to find. It's got copper on it, so it's made of copper. Well, I'm assuming that's all copper. <laughs> it's got writing on the inside though, kind of weird. Bling, bling 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 <laughs> hey guys thanks for watching uh, I just made a quick you know uh, slip in slip out the waves started coming in the wind started coming in my lips are burnt to a crisp here's the ring that's the wrap up for today you guys saw a couple pairs of sunglasses a couple vapes that's about it love you guys see you tomorrow oh hey Hit the thumbs up before you leave. I need a few more likes out of these videos. I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you.